Did you know there are easy ways to download product materials from platforms like Taobao, 1688, and Ping Duo? Let's show you how. Now for the best results, I suggest you download these apps in advance. If you use Android or iOS, it's an app called AZ Screen Recorder that can allow you to record your screen. If it's Apple or Windows, I suggest downloading OBS Studio. All of these are free to use, but it will definitely help you download the content easier. Let's start out with Taobao. Now I'm going to be going to the desktop version first, but you want to first log into your account. If you don't have a Taobao account, you can simply create an Alipay account that I show you how to do so in this video. It just makes it easier if you log in to your account beforehand. Now, if you get lost in this website, you can use Google Chrome to translate the website into English right here or by right clicking and clicking translate to English, but I'm gonna keep this in Chinese because it's pretty easy to use. So I'm gonna look for a product that I like and I want to use for my website for marketing materials. This statue looks pretty nice. Now to save a picture, you simply click on the picture, right click and save image as, and you'll be able to just save it onto your desktop. You can also look into the product descriptions, you can see all kinds of photos. Just right click the photo and save the image as. See, this is like important information for people that want to know how big it is. And it goes into great detail about the product. Then you can use photo editing software like Canvas or Photoshop if you have it, and then do any additional text you want to add to it or any animations. But hold up, you want to ask permission first. You don't want to just simply copy and paste the product and put it on your website. Most of these sellers will be happy to oblige if you're promoting their products so more people can buy it, but it's always good to check. So be careful about just copying and pasting images. It doesn't hurt to contact the seller directly. And if they end up getting more sales, more than likely they won't care. Sometimes you can go a step further and the sellers may be able to even give you the source code so that you can edit the original file. If there's like a lot of text that you want to edit on the file. They may be willing to give you that. Now that's for the photos of the product, but what if they have videos? How would you go ahead and download that? So let me look for a product that most likely has a video. So here I found a video of the product that I want to download. And of course, first you want to ask the supplier if you can use it because it's already nicely edited and you just want to maybe make some tweaks. But if you want to go a step further, then you're going to have to use the OBS software I told you to download earlier. So if you're using the desktop, you can't just simply right click and save the video. You have to go ahead and use OBS software to do so. So it's actually the software that I currently use. And here you can see uh, it might look a little trippy, but here you can see what's going on. You're going to need to create a scene where you can maybe call it desktop. And then in the sources, you're going to need to create a display capture. So right now I'm capturing the display. You just sim simply press add display capture and then follow the steps to capture your screen. You can even go a little further and minimize or maximize the amount of the screen you want to record as I just showed you here. Maybe you just want to record this little square so you get the whole video in and then you can get the content. Uh, you may have to do some work by making sure that you add the right audio source. So the audio input, the audio output capture, you're gonna need to collect the audio output capture to make sure you get the audio from the video that you're playing here and save it. Then you simply record it and then you can edit it later on software like Premiere Pro or Windows Movie Maker. There's, there's tons out there. Uh, you can also ask the supplier to see if they're willing to give you the source file. Um, and then you can change it to English in your case because this will all be in Chinese. I recommend not getting any voice from the video, but instead getting the source file and maybe changing the subtitles and changing everything to English and using your own voice. It shouldn't take that much work. Now let's go into the mobile device. How would you save the content into your mobile device? Well, let's go onto the phone. And here you can see I can open Taobao and log in. 
And I want maybe this statue of Ace. Click into the store. So if it's a photo, you can just hold, hold press down, and you'll be able to, here you can see the button here that says save photo or download photo. So now let's look in how to download Taobao videos on the mobile application. So here I'm logged into Taobao and I found a product where I want to download the video here. But you can't just download it by long pressing the video and downloading it, right? So you need to use the AZ video recorder. So here you can see the AZ video recorder and then you will select to actually record your screen, make sure it records everything, especially the audio. After you have activated AZ Video Recorder, you will then simply go to the video you want to watch, just let it play, and at the end you'll have the video downloaded and finished to go. Now when you finish downloading with the video recorder, you can simply select to send it to another WeChat account, a WhatsApp account, or directly to a computer, to a cloud, so it's very convenient to do that. So now let's go and talk about 1688. So here on the desktop, I'm going to be showing you how to download the video. But you guys already know how to download the pictures. You just select a product that you want. Then you right click the product and click save image or go down and get some more details in the product description. But I want a video, so let me look for a product that has a video. There you go. This is the tennis racket they're selling. Now again, as I mentioned, always try and get it from the supplier because you may get the source file that you can edit the video yourself, but you can always use OBS to record your screen and the audio of the video. So from that point, you just maximize the video here. And as you're recording it, you'll get the, the video footage. This may not be the ideal video to share, with the audience as a product, but you can see for other products that have really good editing that you can use it as video footage for your e-commerce store. And lastly, let's go into the 1688 platform. So first you need to log into 1688 as I'm logged in right here. You can log in using your Taobao account. It's very easy to log in. I have many tutorials on how to do that, but you should already know how to do that. And I'm gonna select a product. Now this product has videos and images, so I'm gonna go with the image first. Just click on the image, long press, and click on this button here to save it to your cell phone. But if you want the video footage right here, as advertisements, again, you're gonna to have to open the AZ screen recorder here. As you open it, record your phone, and as your phone's recording, select the product video, play on full screen. After the video's been recorded onto your phone, you can save it to your phone, send it to your desktop, and then use any editing like that. And again, you can always contact a supplier directly to possibly get the source files. Now, before showing you how to do it with Pinduoduo, consider subscribing and liking the video for more content about improving your e-commerce business, especially if you're sourcing from China. Now, let's start with Pinduoduo and how you do it on the desktop version. Disclaimer, you need to access a Chinese IP network to be able to see this website in the first place. You can try free trials from CyberGhost just to try it out, but essentially you need a VPN to access the Chinese network. So for Pinduoduo, you will go to the wholesale version of Pinduoduo, which is pfa.pinduoduo.com. Again, you need a Chinese network to access this. Otherwise, it's going to ask you to log in as a supplier like you see here, and it won't work. I currently have my VPN turned on, so I'm going to turn off my VPN, and you're going to see what I mean. My VPN is now turned off. I go to the same website, and now I can use it. So here you can see different products and categories. So if you see a product you like, you can click on that product, see the picture you want to download and simply right click and save as. You can also see more marketing materials down here that you can right click and save as or take a snapshot and use it. Now again, please get permission from the supplier before doing so. If you want the video, you can't simply download it like you would like, but uh, maybe not this, this might not be an ideal video. To get the video recording, you would simply use a system like OBS to be able to get 
the video on your desktop. Now that's for the desktop version, but now let's go into the mobile version of Peen Global. So here I can just open Peen Global. Uh, you can log in using your WeChat, or you may not even need to log in, but you need to download the app preferably. But if you have a login account with WeChat, it's very easy to use. So you can select a product. This one has a video and images. So if I want to get the image, I would open the image, hold it, and then click on save image. If you want to download the video that plays, because they have pretty good advertising and editing, you simply go to the AZS screen recorder, activate the recording, and then play the video. And after you finish the recording, you'd be able to save it into your desktop and do any editing you need to do. But it's always best to get permission and the source file from the supplier. So now you know how to download the needed product marketing materials to set up your e-commerce store or advertise products. But out of all the platforms I just showed you, which one is better for your business? Check out this video that shows you the difference between Pinball Do and 1688 and shows you which one you should consider for your e-commerce business.